Coco, what are you doing, fatty? Hmm? Nobody's missing any meals around here. What are you doing, crazy? <laughs> Kenzie. Lord, the cat crazy this morning. It's kind of cool out here. Actually, it's, no, it's not kind of. It really is. <laughs> but anyway. <clears throat> well, good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday. Late kind of message today, but nonetheless... Some of you might have seen uh, our Dowdy Ferry Animal Commission, our night crew. Along, uh, Jeremy and I and the night crew <coughs> were out late, late, late last night doing some rounds of some areas that are known dumping areas and unfortunately finding some horrific stuff. And, um, and we hope that, that through bringing about awareness and uh, keeping the word out there that in time we will make a difference um it's not about giving up and actually the night was just really weird we came across all kind of other issues regarding some strange situations with people and so anyway um it's all relevant and uh we're here to uh make a change make a difference um uh and which also brings my thought today on Keeping it in perspective. <clears throat> um, but anyway, we appreciate y'all following us and your support. If you want to help us with our, ca our camera fund, we were out changing out batteries. Uh, they have to be changed at every few days, um, which are quite expensive. Uh, to, and then, of course, then all the uh, pictures on the cameras have to be run through to see what we catch, what we find. And so... Uh, and, and hopefully we will catch more dumpers and get more uh, license plates and whatnot. So anyway, we again, we, we, we really appreciate your support, cross-posting, uh, and also reporting any animal uh, uh, suspect abuse or injustices in your neighborhood. It takes all of us. Again, like my thought, uh, like I said, my thought today is on uh, keeping it in perspective. Um, <clears throat> you know, here at the holidays, it seems like, um, even more so than all the rest of the time. Um, you know, things get skewed real easily. Um, you know, I mean, what is it from October on, we start seeing, you know, Christmas music getting played at the stores, and here it is not even Halloween, and, you know, it's easy to think, bottom line, it's easy for things to be uh, misconstrued or us to not be able to keep it in the right perspective based on circumstances or environmental or society or so yes it's easy to get confused and and forget why we celebrate certain things why we are involved in certain things because our perception is skewed and our perception of something might not be um, might get lost in translation because of all those factors and then some so, you know, here at the holidays, we, we need to remember that, um, you know, it's a stressful time for a lot of people, and, uh, you know, there's a lot of the hustle bustle and uh, financial headache and, you know, people not having enough money and maybe some people not having, you know, losing their jobs and, and all kind of issues, family health issues, loss of life, um, deaths in the family. Um, and it's real hard to keep upbeat sometimes. And keep things in perspective and also remember that Christmas is about uh, Christ and not about how many gifts we give and get uh, it's not about you know going broke at Christmas uh, you know to keep up a, a persona or keep keep up with the Joneses or whoever on on you know having a uh, a false sense of, of what Christmas is about and so um, we you know it's real important it's real important that we take some of our expectations off of other people and vice versa even of ourselves about you know trying to keep things in perspective and not have certain expectations from others that really cause more grief and heartache and and dismay because we have these expectations that are unrealistic and that uh, cause stress sometimes. You know, um, 
the true, you know, the, the, the true blessing is to really count our, to count our blessings and then count the things that we have to be grateful for, whether it is good health, whether it is a stable job, whether it is a car that drives good and not all the, you know, the bells and whistles that we can maybe expect or that want, we want because we're geared to be that way because again, society pretty much makes it a competition from one year to the next of who can get the best, the best, biggest, whatever. And so we need to keep our perspectives in line and in balance with what's really what really matters. Um, having good connections with those that we love, having good communication, um, keeping our values in check, um, staying grounded, and just giving thanks for th where thanks is due. And so, um, and not to be so hard on ourselves and others. In this, in, at this time of the holidays especially. I mean, of course, it's not just a cyclical thing, but, you know, that we take to heart um, what's <coughs> pardon me, what is important. And, um, and try to stay on track with ourselves and what our motivation is and our goal and, and keep it realistic, keep it transparent. And, and, and be open to whatever the messages are from above in the process in, so in order for us to find maybe some true meaning or true purpose in whatever we're doing or being a part of, uh, whatever culmination or effort or friendship or, so it is all about perspective. And so today, just, you know, if you need to retune yourself or get yourself in line and, you know, make that decision that, you know, this year I'm not gonna be all about having to prove something to whoever about, you know, all these excessive, extravagant, go broke gifts, uh, if it's in that regard, or keep it in perspective about what really matters in life. What really matters are the people you love and that you can be yourself with and that are in line with you in having good morals and values and, you know, that want to work on becoming their, their, their highest good. And so, <clears throat> that's my thought today. And I hope that you have a blessed Sunday, the rest of your weekend, and just try to keep it perspective and not get overwhelmed with everything that the holidays, and especially, uh, seems to make everyone want to stop and uh, take heed to, which really is not what Christmas is about anyway. So, uh, be true to you, uh, make your day count, try to keep it in perspective, and know that you have a lot to offer yourself and others. And don't forget to remember what the season is really about, which is Christ above. So live, love, be. Have a beautiful day. Keep it in perspective. Be grateful. Talk at you later.